Welcome to the Armani Talks YouTube channel. I'm your host, Armani Talks. In this channel, I'm helping you level up your communication skills. In this episode, I'm going to be talking about the number one roadblock of consistency. In this world, there are two kinds of people. One group is used by words, while the other group uses words. This sentence, it's going to make sense throughout this episode. When I was a youngster and I was first moving to the United States of America, the little kids, they considered stuff cool or uncool. And around 1997 to 1998, you know what was considered cool? The Backstreet Boys. If you listened to the Backstreet Boys, you were accepted into the Cool Kids Club. If you didn't, then your cool badge was temporarily suspended. So eventually, my brother and I ended up buying a whole bunch of Backstreet Boys CDs to start catching up. We gotta be cool just like all these other kids. And by the time that we ended up getting all those CDs, there was a problem. Unfortunately, Backstreet Boys were no longer considered cool. At this point, it was NSYNC. If you didn't listen to NSYNC, then there was a big problem. Now, you are not considered cool if you did not stay updated. You're still listening to the Backstreet Boys? That's so last year, man. From this era of my life, I was thinking about it. Backstreet Boys, NSYNC. Who from these two groups is still relevant to this day? Justin Timberlake. Sure, the other members are still doing their own thing, but in terms of relevancy with music, Justin Timberlake is still here. What allows him to be so consistent? No way is he going to share what allows him to be so consistent. Incorrect. He already shared it many times. And here's what he says. He says, I have a formula and I stick by that formula. You see, in this generation, a lot of artists are consistently hopping to the next beat maker, the next writer, the next producer. But me, I'm still with the same people that I was with in the beginning of my career. I found my formula and I stick with it. And by sticking with my formula, I've been able to extend my career for so long. Justin Timberlake is consistent because he's simple. The number one enemy of consistency is complexity. That's the number one enemy. Why are people so complex, Armani? Don't they know any better? Shouldn't they be more simple? Yes, they should. But here's the problem. Many people, they're extremely external focused. If they can see it with their eyes, hear it with their ears, smell it with their nose, then it's real for them. Are you saying that's not the case? I'm not saying that's not the case. That's one mode of operating your life with, completely external focused. But true winners, they also understand the value of being internal focused. Before focusing on their behavior a lot, they understand the art of focusing on their thinking patterns. In the beginning of this video, I was talking about how there's two groups of people. One group is used by words, and the other group uses words. Why do you think these people who understand that complexity is a killer of consistency still exhibit complexity? Why is this? Is because their words are not correct. What do you mean? If I ask them, what do you do all day? Or better yet, what is the most important task or tasks in your day? You know how they're going to respond? How? With sentences. So, that's the problem. If you want to fix your mode of thinking, which is going to impact your behavior, 
your most important tasks, it should be reduced from sentences to words. When you can turn sentences into words, that's when you are one of those people who knows how to use words, not get used by it. I see what you're saying, man, but do you mind giving me some examples? I'll give you one example right now. In my day-to-day -day life, it seems as though there's a lot of things going on, but not really. If a person just came into my house today and they're like, uh, Armani, what do you do all day? And this man happens to be a robber, a very unproductive robber. He doesn't want to steal anything from me. He just wants to steal my routine, but not anything of valuable possession, material-wise. This guy puts a gun to my head. He's going to say, go, tell me what you do all day. I'll tell him four words. Consume, create, market, meditate. These are the four biggest drivers of my business, Armani Talks. Consume means to learn. I could either read a book or I could watch these old school videos back and see what I'm doing right and what I could improve. That's consume. Create. Create comes down to creating a relationship, creating content, writing a blog, creation of some sort every single day. Market. All that creation don't mean anything if I'm not getting eyeballs on it. Eventually, I gotta let my work be seen by other people, which is a form of marketing. Meditate. This is an important task because anytime you're in a field where you are currently working with your mind, you gotta keep the mind sharp. It's sort of like an athlete training his or her body. So meditation keeps my mind sharp. This guy, he doesn't have to pull the trigger because he was expecting sentences on sentences. I gave him four words. And with this simplicity, what I'm capable of doing is winning my mind over first, which allows for consistent behaviors to come secondary. Most people, people that are too sense focused, they're focusing on their behavior first. A small group of people who know how to use words focus on their mind first because thoughts influence the behavior. And what influences thoughts? Words. So if you're currently struggling with consistency, you want to reduce. You want to be like Justin Timberlake. All these different beat makers, writers, producers are knocking at Justin Timberlake's door. Uh, please work with us. We're hot right now. Justin's like, no, man, I already got my formula. What's your formula? The formula will present itself when you turn big, hairy, complex sentences, the enemies of the mind and consistency into easy to understand words, which pierce into the subconscious mind and influence long-term behavioral changes. Be consistent because consistency is a real world version of intelligence True street smarts, street smarts, which can never be bought in a book. Thank you for joining the Armani Talks YouTube channel, and I'll catch you on the next episode.